this has come in the box it's a bit larger than I was expecting really but then I hadn't thought about that the actual volume of what it, what it makes anyway here we go there's a instruction book primarily in German but also in English so that's fine there we are the second half is all in German and there's even some recipes is there a nice gelato there? No. Well, I'll see about that. Um, a paddle. Let's take the item out of the box. There we are. And in here, there's the motor to go on top. This all feels decently made, I have to say. That's my first impression of it. And I presume that clips in... Like that. Switch on the top. Plug on the end. Which is a proper... UK plug on the end of a... This is a... I can tell this is a continental fitting here. But this is this is fine. Doing this is fine. It's a proper adapter. It's got the right sizes. It's the right distance away around the edges. And it's got a fuse in. So that's fine. That's good. That's great. So, I suppose what I need to do is to read the book. And I think the first thing I've got to do is to chill this down in the deep freeze so i'll put it in the deep freeze tonight and tomorrow morning we'll have a bit of fun with it but i think a different recipe to what's here first thing then in with the fish fingers for 12 hours 450 mils of milk four egg yolks if they're small three if they're large and 75 grams of sugar. The egg yolks in with the sugar. I'd normally put those straight in, of course. And a gentle beat until they're creamy. Gently warming the milk. While it's very gently warming, get a vanilla pod and slice it with a sharp knife. Single cut all the way along to let the vanilla nicen us out in a moment. Little bubbles starting to form around the edge of the pan. Time to turn it off. Right, a ladle of milk. It's only half a ladle there. That'll do to get me started. I'll put a little bit more in, shall I? So that's about a ladle full in there. Thanks to the beater. Check it's visible, it is visible. Straight away starting to go custody. A little bit more milk in. A bit clumsy there. And now I'll mix this in with the milk.
Right, back onto the heat and heat until we get the custody thing going. In with a vanilla pot. In it goes. There we are. I'm all for using these silicone things now. Now it's coating the spoon. Off with the power. And that's it. There we are. Let that cool down. And then into the fridge overnight. Next morning then, fine mesh strainer and our well chilled stuff. Through it goes. There's the Another pod at the bottom. It's a shame we can't use that again. But I'm afraid I'm going to give this a, a bit of a scrape. Get as much out as possible. As much yumminess out as possible. On with this. Notice how that doesn't fall out, that's really good. Clip it on and churn. It's already icing up at the edges, of course. Let me see if it can show you. No, it's, the ice is gone now, it's managed to peel it off. About six or seven minutes, I think. Peering in from above, you can see it setting. This is about three minutes in. Time to see what's in the pot, I think. Pretty good. and tasting delicious. Now me, I'm going to put it into some little glasses. These glasses I've had 10 minutes in the deep freeze just to chill them down. And there's the gelato. There we are. Far nicer than traditional ice cream. <laughs>